and welcome to this week's episode from the Veg Grail Podcast. Today, sun shining, it's been quite wet underfoot but we've had a few frosts I mentioned last week and it's started to kill a lot of us things off that have meant now I can just really start tidying up. So let's we'll start with this old pumpkin the Big Max that I grew my two stone pumpkin on which I was very pleased with right there. as we can see it's dead which is great There. And that. There we go. If it wasn't dead before, it is now. Uh. Uh. This wood I've got here is rotten. But we'll pull out of my just to dry it out a bit. And then all I've got to do is stream this area, which I won't be doing today because I haven't got my streamer. Now this bed here is where I did grow sweet corn, uh, French beans and leeks. Well, everything has now been harvested and saved and done what we can. So this bed is really empty. So we we'll get this taken apart. Now for next year that bed is going to be peas and beans. In fact they'll be overwintered in this bed. I've got them all growing in my greenhouse at the moment. Well the peas I'm starting to harden off. So they'll be coming in here pretty soon. So I need to get this bed ready. So what I'm doing now, I'm just hoeing it. Lock everything down. And then I'll get the rake.
And I'm actually hoping to get this planted up next weekend. If certainly the peas. The broad beans might need just a little bit longer before they go out. But once this is all clear. Fill it up with horse manure and compost. And that will all be okay after that. These are the old sweet corn roots. They can probably just be covered in horse manure, so I'm not too worried about those. Still getting cooch grass coming through, but we're getting there with it. It's getting better than what it was. Leftover leak. The worst of it up anyway. Let's try and get these bits in the corner out. Like
So there we go, I think we're nearly there today because let's just get that bit of everything that is there is basically cut off and I can't be bothered to pick every single little piece out. So we'll count that as complete. That's been 20 minutes work. This one bed, 20 minutes work. I'm happy with that. What's there? We'll wilt down. Hopefully it doesn't rain today. I don't think it will. That'll wilt down today and then next week it will just be covered in horse manure, well watered horse manure and bloody for planting. Well the thing I've been doing today, it's been a job that I've been wanting to complete for a while, is this bed here. Now I've built the bed, you've seen that in the past, I've filled it with manure and now I've started planting in these strawberries which are they're, uh, yeah, they're looking good, they're planted, we'll, um, I've watered them in, we'll let them grow over this season and see how they get on before they uh, we cut anything back and what have you, but we've got to keep them watered. They should do okay, And but they have basically came, some from this bed here and some from this bed at the top here, as you can see where I've been clearing. Now, these strawberries actually done really well for me last year so I'm kind of wanted to keep them but they're in the wrong place so I've moved them to that bed and there's still a lot of strawberry plants left in there so I've got to dig those up and I hate hate getting rid of plants that are good so I'll be potting those up and then have to find something to do with them I may keep them I may sell them I may give them away if anybody watching wants any strawberry plants, give me a shout and I'll see if I can post some to you. Um, that's about really all I can do with them. I've also put in, a bit late, but we've got some plants here, some cauliflower and a couple of rows of cabbages. These are winter spring ones, so um, yeah, we'll see how they get on. I, they are a bit late to get them in, but I kind of had them they need I need to get them in so I've done it now and that's basically where the sweet potatoes were growing that I dug out last year last week even but yeah well progress is getting there we've just got to clear the rest <laughs> 